Are you having one of those days? When you can't figure where to find love or whether the love you have is really love? When you can't seem to find your own place in this vast universe? When you don't have control over everything that's happening to you and nothing goes your way? When you realize you are not who you wanted to be? The Girl Oracle deck is here to serve as your guide. Each card will guide your spirits towards the answers you are looking for, or path you are meant to walk, or truths you have to realize and live. Whether it's love, relationships, dreams, enemies, or other struggles you face as you journey to your destiny, let the Girl Deck by Sal be your guide. Come and join me at my first meetup in Los Angeles and let's explore the girl deck together. Hi Sagis, welcome to my channel. We're doing your monthlies, no dailies until I finish the monthlies. And as always, I probably will talk about Vedic idea of astrology with a Sag. I always talk about it with you guys. Okay. Um, before we start, there is going to be a brief announcement. Okay. For the Extendaholics, which people who likes to watch Extended Read, Always first check the Glamour Box because the Glamour Box comes with free extended reading. It is totally free and it is basically the same price. And you get things that I create, things that we make, okay, custom. So I don't understand when people just get the digital file, which that's why I created something of value so that people can get something and not just I watch it and then that's it. It's up to you. I give up because I have to explain this every time. Okay, And then also my webinar is coming soon in March, which I must say, I expect a lot of Gemini and a lot of Sag. Okay? Because that's where you're going to start your Rahu Ketu. Think of it as Saturn as just like a walk in the park. Okay, And then Rahu Ketu moving, that's where you need to. That's why I said, like, you know, remember? Last time, um, I believe um, I opened the the what do you call it? The prediction for the for the chart, okay. And um, oh, which reminds me about the chart. Okay. <laughs> so yes, um, so that's that one. And then there's the webinar, okay. So, but there's still six that I'm still working on. And then I know that we just got something from last uh, the last time that I opened it. Uh, so I'm still finishing the six. It's kind of lengthy, okay. So. Um, just wait for it, and I'll make it up to you, Sage. Okay, so let's begin. This is your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Um, monthly, so we will first do your checkup. Okay, uh, here's the checkup. Cartman C. Cartman C. Here we go. Okay, this is the part where I just, uh, you know, sit down. How are you, Kathleen? How are you, Mark? Who is Mark? Today is Mark, Mark, Mark. Okay. Um, you can be Roger, you know, it's like, sit down, you know, it's okay, sit down, um, we'll catch up, um, of course, I can always hear Ryan, doesn't get away inside my head, okay, someone who wants to make it up to you, I can see it here, whoever that person is, here we go, they're learning, they say, I learned my lesson, okay, here we go, Patches. Jack of Clubs, someone has an idea. That's my idea card. Strength card, Leo Energy, of course. King of Clubs, oh wow, they learned. Okay, someone really learned. Ah, three of diamonds, see? That's why I said earlier, I saw already, it still came out. So that energy is very persistent. You could be connecting with someone who has a name that is an R. Jack of Clubs, the Strength card, and the King of Clubs, and the Two of Diamonds. How does it work? Let's see. This person probably gave you a paper, gave you a sheet. I hope it's not a napkin, but can be a napkin. Maybe you need to wipe up something in your face, Sag. What were you eating? Gives you a paper. I have this idea. If it's not like that, it's a message. Here's the idea. You will be mesmerized. This person is going to say, I look up to you so much. Um, and then really, you feel humble. Yes, there's someone, they can, they can be someone who has a big influence, a lot of people. It's a crowded energy. I feel there's a lot of crowd, a lot of crowd. 
the crowd. I swear, when I watch my videos, I feel so ashamed on how I look like a lot of crowd, a lot of crowd. <laughs> Why do I do this? I don't know. Okay. It's a lot of crowd. They look at you and you feel like you're humbled. It's like, thank you. And then, Kia Clubs, they took a while to give you this message. Or the Tree of Diamonds, they feel that he's not winning the lottery jackpot. They feel that in the stage of time in process this is the time now that they're ready and they're ready because they admire you they see your potential they feel like you're the next big thing they feel like you're an iphone <laughs> <laughs> they feel that or this person feels that or the, you know that there's so much that they can achieve with you to be successful with you am i sad today we don't know yet no uh -huh. To be with you. Potential, potential, potential. That's your checkup. Okay. Here we go for the tarot. People are going to be so addictive to that checkup. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> Here we go. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Here comes your tarot. Let's uh, begin. Let's see here. Eight of Pentacles. Putting in the work, hard labor, working with your hands, crafty. Mm -hmm. This is your mundane. This is devotion. This is commitment. Whatever you're doing, you stay in that course, you'll reach, um, you know, you will be able to help other people that you, there are other people that you, you want to help. But right now, you're maintaining your focus on yourself. Eight of Pentacles. That's the other person. Knight of Pentacles, of course. A Turinian who's after you. Someone is chasing. Look at that one. They chase you. You know how like someone chasing you? Beep beep. You know, that kind of energy. Beep beep. You know, um, they're not like that. You know, that's 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 not Speedy Gonzalez. I, but you know, uh, Roadrunner, right? But this person went so far, went so fast, also that they miss a step. Meaning, they have, they miss a step? How do they miss a step? It's almost like they cross you, they didn't notice that they're already ahead of you. Not that they're ahead, ahead, but it's like, they did too much. And they cross, I'm not sure if they cross boundaries, I don't think so. But it's almost like, because I feel like the card is moving towards away the Eight of Pentacles. So they have to come back. Someone needs to make a Yui here. Okay. Don't get lost. I know. It's only two cards yet. Like this. They wanted to give you something, right? And then they said, it's like, oh, I forgot. I needed to give you this. They made a Yui. There. Oh, wait. That's a caught someone coming back. <laughs> oh, cool. There we go. Eight of Cups. Oh, yeah. You work late. Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Cups. That's a night shift. Okay. So you could be working late night. Working hard for the money, right? Because they never treat you right. Yeah. Probably work doesn't treat you right. Just saying. Also, okay. Eight of Cups, you sad. Um, but emotionally drained can be you're so invested with your career. You know, like, I pour my heart out with my work. It is true. Sad are very driven with regards to their career if it's fun. Not fun, out of there, clocking out, okay, clocking out. Here, you're really devoted, you're so into it that you're willing to put everything. As you leave through the night, this person you will meet, this person will approach you. This is not about the relationship with the cups. I feel like it's what you are committed to right now. It's draining you, but it's fulfilling you. You got me? There you go. That's good. I know you were waiting for me to say that. <laughs> Here we go. Knight of Pentacles. The moon. How is this? I said you are working night. <laughs> this person too, I feel. Let me see. Ah, oh, a moon in Taurus again. Why are the moon in Taurus everywhere? It's moon in Taurus. Okay. Intuition-wise, they're going to feel like, I will get you. You'll be mine. You'll be mine. Oh, okay. 
It's in back of their head. It's in their subconscious. They psyche. Okay. This, this can be a psychic also. They just know. But they don't do anything. <laughs> but they're coming back. Okay. We just had a full moon in Vedic Sidereal in the degrees for me. It happened in Ashlesha. So and moon is ruled by cancer. Okay, so that can be a cancer coming back to you. Let me see. Vice versa, cross watcher. Eight of cups. The full card, there you go. Someone coming to you with the full card. This is the whole I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. I left everything and I'm with you. But the, again, you won't be there. Where are you, Sanj? <laughs> it's almost like someone's gonna visit you and you're not there. Or they're gonna miss a step. Someone keeps saying miss a step. Queen of Cups, and I said Syrian. Here we go. <laughs> okay. So, selfless, loving energy. Taking a chance on you. I'm not sure if you will do the same. I'm not sure if you can invest right now with the person. You're so committed to that Eight of Pentacles of yours. It can be your student, or they're a student, and then there's nothing for you to give right now. But this person has everything to give to you. And very intuitive, to the point of psychic. Because this is a spiritual person. This can be you, though. This is spirit, right? The fool is a spirit before it becomes a magician. Queen of Cups is intuitive. The moon is our intuition, also. So look how psychic this person is. Uh-huh. This can be you. But this is someone, if they're not psychic, they know how to trust their intuition, which is a big deal. Meaning, they don't doubt. When you trust your intuition, you have good connection to the source. You do as you're told. This person is like that. Like, I know. I know. And when you have that conviction, that's when it happens. That's when it manifests. Because if there is no morsel of doubt, oh, it will happen. Because you already claim the person. You already claim the energy. I'm not sure why I'm teaching you how to get what you want. <laughs> so you, you envelope. This person is like that. They envelope the energy. But this can be you. That we will be together. We will be together. I'm not sure how this is going to resonate with you. Meaning, because it's like it totally surrounding you. They're coming towards you to wrap around you and to just be with you. And then, you know, you just have to give me a chance. Give me a chance. The full card. Okay. So let's see. Because this person is already circling around you. Okay. It's already in your circle. You already know that their energy is just there. It's the energy you feel. It's just there. Okay? Well, they, at least they don't practice juju. Queen of Wands practice juju. <laughs> this is not that one. Okay. They're just naturally psychic. They just... Natural psychics are... K2 first house. Um, can be. It reflects them past life. You know, it's like they know what they do. They know, they know themselves right away. So that's a good intuition. Meaning they know themselves. Um... Natural psychics also can be um, Pisces energy, um, depending on uh, how to call that, um, like an Utara, uh, no, Utara Badrapada, or no, uh, um, no, the, the earlier one, um, not the Utara, Utara is the, oh no, yeah, Utara, Utara Badrapada, um, um, Libra Scorpio also, there's a Libra Scorpio that is good, uh, or just Libra, I feel, okay, Astrologer, this can be good. Um, that's gonna be, um, I forgot, starts with letter S, uh, not Shravana, but I forgot, but there's a Libra, um, Nakshatra, so it can be a Libra also, but their just intuition is on point, uh, they know, they know what they see, they see the stars, they know, this is this person, this can be you, uh, so I'm gonna continue this reading as you connect with a psychic, <laughs> if you're not a psychic, you're gonna connect with someone who just knows, Swati, Okay, there, Swati starts with letter S. Okay, and it's a Cancer Nakshatra, is it? No, it's a Libra Nakshatra, Swati. Yeah. So you connect with an astrologer, or this person just consulted an astrologer. The light is too bright. I'm gonna, okay. So, yeah, so that's that one, okay? So Sadris, I'm gonna continue this reading as someone comes back to you and I feel like they're not gonna let go of you. Okay, or vice versa. Link down there in the description box for everything that you need. Remember, the Glamour box comes with free extended. I can't repeat this as much as I can. It's up to you. Okay? Bye, guys.